Duels of the Cyber Realm, and I'm skipping most of the intro just to get out of the way, even though it didn't really work. Oops. Anyway, now we're facing the Analyst. Also, dude records in a car. Oh, look at all the characters in the background. Hey, Topic. Yes, Jackson. We have a human in this universe? When the idea of your Topic Crime came to be. No, how did it start? Well, it all started with me going to a cafe and meeting two amazing people. Two people that I knew I was going to make an amazing friendship with. And neither of them were you, which means that blushing was pointless. First in line with a unicorn horn and a pony with a robotic expression. Hmm. Did you get some Zarbox? Nice to meet you. I'm Jackson. Nice to meet you, Jackson. Oh, what brings you to this cafe today? Are you thinking of strategy three? Grogar, or are you enjoying what this cafe has to offer? Yes! I'm a big fan of their hot chocolate. They, it is just so delicious. Well, Zarvox and I are wanting to take a break from Grogar and just chill and relax for the day. Chill out with my crew at the schoolyard. Do you mind if I can hang out and get to know you better? It feels like this will be a good time to just get to know a new person. I don't mind. Your thoughts, Zarvox? I don't mind. It would be good to get to know someone outside of the rift. And Digi. Five cups of hot chocolate later. So you want to hear an interesting Surprise idea? Why come back drunk? Deck masters. We take one monster from our extra deck and give it a continuous, once per turn, and a once per door. How's that sound, Digi? I thought I would agree that deck masters was a bad idea. So, deck masters, eh? I actually like it. I do want to try out this Galaxy Photon deck on someone, so you be my. You do realize you'd be making up the effect. Opportunity to try out this deck. My deck master will be number ninety-five. Oh Jesus! What about you? I'll use my deck spot deck and use it use it as my deck master. Deck spot jet and oh, see boy. if we can give it all I got in this duel. Bring it on, Digi. All right then. I actually have thought about dueling in the Ponyville Square. Spacious field that has a great view of the castle. Hmm. Well, I'm in, Digi. This actually be a great place instead of using the Cyber Realm so much. On with the duel, then. Shall I flip a coin to see who goes first? Sure, why not? I call Tails. I'll call Heads. Edge. All right. It looks like I go first. I start first by activating Pot of Greed. I'll set three cards, and I will special summon for my paw, Volcan Thrasher. I'll end my turn. It is my move. I'll draw. I activate Pot of Greed. I'll then send my Pendulum Scales. I'll set oh boy. Scale with Scale One. Data spot 008 and scale 10. Data spot 007. I did always think that there was a data spot 007 because they're like two images to change bond at the desk. Thanks to these monsters, I can start seeing monsters from level 2 to level 9. So I'll ping with the little falling monsters. Come forth. Data spot 002, data spot 006, and finally data spot 007. Oh, jeez. Death spots are very dangerous. I'm gonna call them meta, especially because they're a pendulum deck in MR5, but still, it's like. Well, zero zero just be careful. Don't someone. underestimate them. One deck spot card from my deck and add it to my hoof. The base. I add deck spot base to my hoof, and now I'll activate. I'd say they're powerful in dual links, but everything's good in dual links, so you know. Each deck spot card on the field. Except for except for junk for some reason. I'll then normal summon Dex 003 and activate the fact express summon Dex 001 and then perform a synchro summon. Oh boy. I'll tune Dex 001 to Dex 006. Level 7 synchro summon. Docking strength, courage to protect the Earth's peace. Synchro summon. Envoy of love and justice. How to do PMC. I believe that was Porta Attack Force. Not so fast. Maybe there's a Luna's synchronous chance. Solid strike. 
Leo's too, and then Luna really uses it as well, because I know Luna says that quote, but I don't know about Leo. I probably remember it more for Luna than Leo, maybe just because it's a, it, maybe it's just because it's a signature right, monster being used by another monster, player. And I have no cards that can help me out right now, I will just end my turn, so it is your move, Digi. Draw! I'll have bring my second pot of green. Of course. I will now activate Luminous Dragon Ritual. Oh boy. By tributing Galaxy Crasher, I can ritual. There are a total of two ritual summons in all of uh Zexo. Paladin of Photon Dragon. This guy and Blackluster Soldier used by the Nazi Yugi of the Sons. By it, Plays kings, queens, and jacks, neck for God's sake. Now, I will sad thing is that's still two more rituals than by D's head. I send three dragon monsters from my deck to the graveyard, and you'll have to banish three monsters from your deck. Oh Jesus! You banish three galaxy dragons. Well, two galaxy eyes, photon dragons, and a galaxy it's dragon, but same battle. general idea. I will have galaxy eyes attack your desk bot zero zero three. Not so fast, Digi. I'll activate test mode zero zero three. It gains five hundred for each test mode card on the field. There's a total of six, so it gains three thousand attack, making yeah. it stronger than your galaxy eyes photon dragon. Yeah, see, that's I'll why desk bots are dangerous. Twin twisters. By discarding a card, I target two of your Pendulum Scout monsters. And for that, Deskbot's attack boost is now cut. Dodge the bullet there, Digi. Wait, what? Many of the attack was supposed to be 4,000, and then it was increased by 3,500, not 2,500. Lightsaber versus beam struggle. What should happen is that you shot him out of the sky. I'll end my turn. Everyone's ever seen Kermit versus Same Donald. To get the stool. All the heavy cards. It's my move. I'll draw. This card may be able to help me win the duel. I'll activate part of the equivalents. The oh boy. My three banished monsters that you banished due to your dragon master's pet. Of course you have that. Draw, draw one more card. I activate deck master's deck spot jets effect. Oh boy. By destroying one Dexbot card I control, I can destroy one card on your side of the field. I destroy Dexbot 002 to destroy your face down. Kaboom. With that, I will end my turn. Your move, Digi. Give it all you got in the stool. Draw! <sighs> there isn't much I can do in this turn. So I'll sign another card and it's back to you. I'll draw. I summon Deckman 003. Activates my game and chain my trap. Dar backwards. Okay. I shuffle all of the Dexbot 002 that's in my graveyard and then draw one more card. I then activate Dexbot 003's back. This card is summoned from the deck. Dexbot 004. Then I activate Pony Boot. Which allows me to draw two cards. I will then set those two cards face down and it'll be your move, Digi. I end my turn. It is a lot to play with desk bots. Draw! Hmm. I haven't seen this card in a little while. I activate. Hot agreed! Card of oh, hello. Anime effects. Thank you, Digi, for helping me reload my entire hand. So now I may have an even bigger chance of winning this duel. It just may depend on the cards that I draw. Now. I activate Monster Reborn to bring back Galaxy Ice Phantom Dragon. Next, I activate my trap, Jar Avarice. Oh, of course you have one By too. By adding five cards from my graveyard and putting them back into my deck, I can build and draw one card. Now, I activate Galaxy Exposition. Exposition, not exposition. Since I a Galaxy Ice Photon Dragon, I can try to summon another one from the deck. Hmm, I'm gonna go with Galaxy now, Knights. Time for At least I, or maybe that's just me, because I'm tired of I will overlay my two Galaxy Eyes in order to Z-Summon. I like how it explodes. Oops, hit my mic, sorry. Number 62, 
Galaxy Eyes Photon Prime Dragon. Yeah, boy. Now, I will overlay that one what? in order to summon... Dark Matter? Full Armor Photon Dragon. Of course. Alrighty then, I'm guessing you're going to attack that. I love Full Armor Photon, Photon, Dra Photon, Photon Dragon. Dragon just because of the manga. I, I probably said this before, but kite slash kaito overlays photon dragon with two equip spells. As in, the equip spells are also overlay units. So if you're wondering about the equip spell effect and when to become overlay units, that's where that's from. I can still get through soon. I must have faith and I must have hope in my cards. Rest assured, if there's ever like an alternative version of a card and you're like, where the frick did this come from? Odds are mong is a safe bet. And for that, it can do piercing damage. So I'll have Photon Dragon to attack your other death slot. Oh yeah, there's a funny ruling with Fairy Mirror as well. If you equip it to your opponent's monster and then you set a monster, they take the damage because of how the wording works. Oh god damn it. <laughs> it's on the wording because it's technically because I think the wording is like now, your opponent takes the image turn. or something like I'll that. So it's like that. Yeah. Of destruction. That makes sense, probably I not, but that's just how it works. And banish it. I will banish your field spell. It's a contractually obligated, not blue eyes a thing. Where's the one for DDDs? Bye bye. So, DG, with all that said, after all that, would you like to end your turn? Yeah. I'm hoping oh, we can have this one end my reaction in the next turn, so I can get the main advantage. I have faith that these cards will help me win this duel. I just need to take a deep breath and draw. Let's get it started, everyone. I activate polarization to fuse the three cyber dragons in my hand, bring forth a more powerful. Oh, jeez. Mechanize dragon of steel, merging together, and bring out the way of victory. Fusion summon, appear, cyber, and dragon. This is good. Now I'll normal summon death plus 004. And then, since I have two of the same levels, I can overlay the two death plus 004s I have to Did build. Did you give him a hand them. refresh with the card the sanctity? Warrior of hope and warrior of light shine forth the swords of might. And please help me win whether it be double or nothing. Exceed summon. Appear number 39, you topic double. Then That's a pretty good. Yeah. Attaching one overlay unit. Summoning I chance. Add my, my hoof, double or nothing. Oh and boy. then allow me to exceed summon another utopia monster. The warrior of hope and warrior of light shine forth as swords of might. And please help me win and protect the light within the hearts of others and the heart. And lighten ourselves. Heart, light, light, it's dark, 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 heart. The yeah. original, number 39, Utopia. I will then activate Pot of Avarice, where I shuffle five monsters from a graveyard Utopia into the deck. Utopia is debatably the worst boss, boss monster. boss monster. one card and end So debatably, you're mooded. To be fair, it blows itself up. At least Draw. the other, at least the, even the vanillas don't do that. It's completely subjective. I activate Raigeki. Again, one could also argue that Utopia has so many alternative versions that it doesn't even fucking matter. Well, I probably should attack my last turn, so this wouldn't have happened. Probably. Well, the more you know. Alright. I'll have full armor photon dragon attack you directly. This is going to hurt. Another magic cylinder! Got you to half health. Now, I'll end my turn. My move. I'll draw. I'll activate one of my face downs. It sees your born. I'll bring back to the have it attaching season to Uh oh. Then I'll have Utop Utopia attack full armor photon dragon. Then you attach the effect. Negate the attack and double or nothing. Negate the attack. Negate the attack. I'll activate from my hoof. Double or nothing. I'll double its attack and allow me to attack one more time. Let's finish this dragon off, Utopia. Rising Sun Slash! I 
I think you'll regret playing that fact. Why? Because now it's you that will get cylinder. This oh, jeez. That's game. Yeet. Now, the wise man once said that fate is not good friend attempt. <laughs> GG. I just remember, wasn't it supposed to be attacked by some like scarred up disfigured mother flipper? Great duel analyst. Thank you, Digi. It was not only a fun and amazing time dueling with you, but also I was able to finally give these cards a try. It's I only was able to use them against my brother, and even then it was still just a bit of an easy time dueling. You actually gave me a lot of uh, Things I need to do to give it all I got, if you will. So, where did you get them in the first place? eBay! To make a long story short, Digi, I was in a card shop getting a second deck after making my Elemental Hero deck. Uh, then, all of a sudden, a light was shining, and I knew it was the deck that I needed to get. I still don't know how these pendulum cards work and their capabilities and or potential. You pendulum summon with I them. It's something in the making. It's something I've been trying to research and everything. However, I have heard of a legend of four powerful cards. One, Exceeds, Fusion, Synchro, and finally, Pendulum. I have One, no idea where that could be. I, can, I can't wrap my head around. Integration Summon! A legend that whoever has these cards can use them for either good or can use them for destruction. What is it, the Keyblade? I see. Sounds like one of those legendary rare card deals, kind of like the Dragon Dealers. Yes, I highly advise to stay safe with one of these four cards. I don't know how much destruction these cards can cause, but I do know that you and Zarvox Not much. could and, and or can survive these cards. If you need me, you know where to find me, either at Chick-fil-A, this cafe, or whatever you can to communicate. I would have found it hilarious if, like, since sure Odd Eyes evolved into the Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon, I right would have found it hilarious if in, for, if in the end of Arc 5, Zark tries to fuse all the dragons together again, and he's like, oh wait, this thing's a pendulum now. It doesn't really work. Do you help me and Zarbox and some others out against Rongar when the time comes? I know it's basically the same thing, but I yes, would have found it funny, you know? You've been not only an amazing duelist, but I believe we can make an amazing friendship. All of a sudden, I'm do my best to bring my elemental hero deck, because I think dance bots may not be able to help me out in the long run. Basically, their pendulum effects is that you can only pendulum summon these, and it cannot be negated. So that's why I actually had to use the polymerization to bring out Cyber and Dragon, because huh. I couldn't pendulum summon them onto the field and everything. So. Yeah, I don't know. But I think I think you meant to say desk bots only pay to summon desk bots. I guess Jordan isn't the only one with the humor. And it's that, like it's a very popular so archetype. Not only met Digi, but also had the inspiration to make you as a program, someone that can help me out. So I'm a discount Zarbot. Someone that can be there for me when I need them the most. This is crying. Andrew Jackson, that really means a lot to me. Have you been able to talk to Digi after that duel? Nope. I have been able to talk to him a couple of times, and we have been making a little something for you, Utopic. It'll just need a few more days and everything. I hope you understand, Utopic. So that's what she's called, Utopic. I see. That walking cycle, though. Mwah. So, we just forgot about the edge. Oh, hello. That's new. <laughs> the the one flying in the sky. What the heck was that about? Whatever. 